is um bailing or our little hay farm just a quick update we did get a new truck it's a ram 3500 with that little led light bar it's uh it's pretty nice uh hey jacques how you doing good boy oh oops. <laughs> accidentally jumped in the quad oh by the way i did kill no, i get new rims on the quad so that's that's pretty nice anyway we're gonna have to fire up the tlx uh this morning so uh there we go. We've got to fire her up in the morning. Uh, we're going to pick her up, pick up something this morning, and it's a 6510 John Deere. It's going to be used for um, like raking and baling things like, or not really mowing, a sort of. Or I would say yes, all of this and then uh, loading bales and everything will be used for the case. Like I said in other videos, I did find I want to find another, so I did find another. Anyway, if you like the video, like make sure you like subscribe and comment. Oh, also, we got a little update. There is horses. So, we got our horse pasture over there. And we got a feed mixer, a coon. And we got a Joskin water tank. So, that's awesome. Anyway, we're going to go ahead and head down to uh, the store to pick up our new trailer. And uh, those bills did sell, sell for about 3 k So, that was nice. They actually uh, sold for a good price. Dog's back at the dog house. Well, that's good. You should know. Okay. Pretend you did not see the feet. Alright. Now, for back to realism, um, I did not just hit a pole and do a barrel roll onto the side of the road. But, uh, we're going to keep on trucking down the road, passing, probably go down the So when uh, we're getting pulled up, we're, we're pulling up here to the place. Couldn't use the words for a sec. Got to throw on that jigger. Kill it, baby. Sounds so good. The Detroit sound. Trailer, and here's the place we're gonna be picking it up right over here. How convenient! So we'll just park on the side of the road over here. All right, we'll put the ramps down. Put our flashers up. And uh, the, I already paid the guy uh, in the place, so he he's already good. But here we go. We've got a six. Oh, not a sixty-five. It's a sixty-six ten. I forgot about that. <laughs> anyway. I, well, on the market, it said 6510, but uh, here it is. So it has no beacons, so that's that's really good. I don't like beacons on tractors, but our case has it. Oh well, you gotta live what you have. Anyway, we'll go ahead and hop up in it. Let's uh look at the uh very detailed in here. Pretty cool out this morning. About 56. Come on, girl. There we go. We'll let it uh, sit there for a couple minutes. Uh, we'll come back here. Uh, the truck is... Let me just check. Yes, okay, so the truck is in park. Uh, we'll go back. We're, we're going to go um, ahead and load up. Or load up the tractor on the trailer. So, let's go ahead and put it in dry for a scooter. Oh yes, it sounds good. I guess this guy had a hay farm as well or something. <clears throat> anyway, I'll go ahead and pull out of here. And uh, here we go. Try to get in there. There we go. There we go, guys. 
gonna throw some trap uh, traps straps on it and we'll go ahead and make sure the brakes in Uh, ramps are uh, folded up. Right. We'll go ahead and get started. We're going to go ahead and turn around. And, or we can take the uh, way up here. I will need to stop by the uh, gas station uh, later. Or they have a gas station up here. I'll stop by it. Anyway, if you're wondering, the map that I'm on is uh, Bucks County, PA. Uh, great map for role plays. I will start be using the Eric Farms when the update to the roads get put in the game again, so that'll be nice. Anyway, we'll go ahead and roll up the hill. And we'll go ahead and listen to the killer Jake break on this thing. Jake break hill. That is. Oh, yes, sir. Anyways. <laughs> Here's the gas station we'll go ahead and pull in here. I need more uh, diesel for the one we have on the uh, or our hay farm, so I might have to uh, go get more diesel for that tank. But we'll, for now, we'll just uh, it should reach, shouldn't it? it should reach. Right, let's get the gas. Oh, it reaches just right. All right, well, so we'll let that fill up. Man, I just I love this tractor. This gonna be perfect for our hay farm. Just in need, because we only have a tractor for now. Maybe somebody's gotten their pair covered, or their car covered, or something. Jeez. Jeez, all these cars have mud on them. Hmm. Oh, now that's a sight you don't see every day. A old Ford Bronco. Man. Anyway, if you want to follow me on Instagram, it's roleplay underscore farms. Get this out of the tank. Alright, there we go. And uh, I do post daily Instagram pictures, or not maybe not daily, but uh, every like two or three days I do post um, farming simulator uh, pics. So I'm going to come up here real fast and we're going to put on a farming simulator pic. And uh, there's that pail from last video that we forgot. That we forgot. But uh, anyway, here's our daily farm sim pic. So there's the pick for farm sim. All right, let's go ahead and roll back over here. All right, so turn in here. Oh, just about hit the fence. That's all right. We got a neighbor up there. He he's having corn. He's going to harvest that corn over there. So that's nice. And we expanded our lot, so we have a bigger field now um we can do lots of more bales for the, uh what are they called for the uh horses so that's nice and we'll go ahead and back this off of the trailer put it in reverse <laughs> the dogs are already sitting there he sees the new green the new green paint look at the suspension check that out Oof. go ahead and roll back here some of you guys were asking, um, what do you all, what do you have all on your farm? Well, I don't have that much actually. Uh, I'll go ahead and stop the tractor so you can see. Uh, I have the tra regular gooseneck uh, trailer. I have a bumper pull. Um, I forget what this is called. Uh, a camper and b camper slash um, toy hauler, and I got a horse trailer. And um, this is a rake for making hay that is the baler that is the mower and that is the windrower you may ask what's the dis uh, difference between a windrower and a uh, tether the tether makes the hay the windrower makes it smooth and nice so that's nice uh we probably will need to go and feed the uh feed the uh horses uh but i already fed them this morning so we'll just need feed for the afternoon and things like that I'm actually thinking about making the uh, tractors come over here. Or here, we'll pull it up over here. Oh, about to hit the lawnmower. Oh, I almost hit the lawnmower. Ooh, what is what? Am I driving today? Anyway, there we go. Park it in the corner, and then I'm going to fire up the MX. First start. Cold start. 
285 warmed up right fast. All right, we're gonna go over here to the, our semi. We'll go ahead and take the um, trailer and we'll park it over here. Um, where actually should we park it? Let's park it over in the back. Oh man, rolling black smoke. Woo hoo, just like that. All right, anyway, enough chit chat. Uh, we're gonna be putting it back here. So, oh, whew. like I'm saying, they're driving today. All right, let's get it released. There we go. Ew, not the radio. Didn't mean to turn the radio on. Oh, the gas pump. That would have not been a good day. I swear, I'm driving the work right now. Anyway, we're for a close, close back in on, in on Detroit. But let's uh, get, get some gas here. And we're going to... Where are we putting this? Well, let's change this for a second. I'll back up in the MX. Uh... We now have 1.1 hours on it from last bid. Let's raise it up a bit. All right, we're gonna put it in the corner over here. There we go. That's something you don't see every day, a case and a John Deere. Usually it's all case or all John Deere. <laughs> anyway, we're gonna hop back up the truck here. Uh, we'll go ahead and put this. I kind of want to put that there and then take the gator. Let's see if we can't start the gator here. Just won't turn over. There we go. Alright. Now that we got that set up, let's bring it over here. Right on over here. Yep, and then we're gonna slip the semi right in the corner back there. So if we can't do that here. Uh, I don't know if this will be a tight squeeze. Oh, we're gonna try to make work. Alright, we're in the building. I was trying. Will, will the stretch frame fit? I think it will. I think it will. And it does. Awesome. Position a little bit. There we go. Lights off. And there we go. So we now have the uh, semi part there and the tractors there. Looks a little bit more organized. Now that that's gone, or that's that's done, we'll hop in the quad and we're gonna go do some. Uh, I'm gonna go to the track. For oh, hold on. Let's uh, take the back road. Or our back side. Oof. A little too fast there. Alright. We'll just hop on the track here. So I built this track uh, in order to have like a little fun with the quads after uh, a little bit of work has been done and you're just getting a little stressed and you need something fun to do. So that's that. Usually it, it don't go like this. Here, I'm going to go back to the so I can show you how it goes so it does it goes like this come back up this way you come here slow down hit the jump but as you can see I almost impaled myself right there or basically did and then you come over here to this jump boom like that come back all around and then it goes there it goes through that jump over there comes back around there come back and then there's come back on this road and then you're back at the site and then you can just keep doing laps and laps anyway guys if you like the video make sure you like and subscribe uh comment if you want to uh or about the favorite part of the video and the share option if you want to do that that's optional uh but it just it shows a lot more support um if you want to follow the instagram it is roleplay underscore farms no caps and i'll see you guys in the next video